I'm here at Alexandra Palace for the biggest YouTube event, Summer in the City. And I'm going to be chatting to the most popular YouTubers in real life. Lovely. Why do you think that this type of event is so popular? You get to meet the YouTubers that everyone sees on the internet and it's really exciting to meet them. No, listen, I am a mummy's boy. <laughs> Experience mixing with other people that do the same sort of things that we do. Insane. They're just normal people who started out just making videos and now they've got like millions of subscribers and we all love them so much just for being who they are. I'm supposed to say but I can just figure it out and hope and pray. I told her my name, I said it's nice to meet you. Then she handed me a bottle of water filled with tequila. I already know she's a keeper. What's it been like meeting the people who are have made you so popular? Like, it's not experience, because an, an event like this, like, you, 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 suddenly you're a celebrity, but just for two days. It's like, if you're in one direction, you are a celebrity always. Yeah. Whereas I walk down the street in, in Camden, where I live, and, and no one, no one stops me, not really. You have got over five million subscribers. I do. How, how did you celebrate? What did I celebrate? How did I celebrate? I don't know that I did, which is a bit... Okay, we need to work, we need to sort this out. Me and you, we're going to go out, we're going to celebrate. Let's celebrate that. I am now joined by Jack and Dean. How are you doing, guys? Very well, thank you. Yeah. You having a good day so far? Yeah, it's been great, yeah. We've just done a panel, a comedy panel. It wasn't even that funny, was it? No, it wasn't. There's was no jokes, nothing. It was just, just talking seriously about writing and stuff. To begin with, did you find it quite difficult to be so honest within your videos? Um, it was a long time decision coming to I think but then once I decided it was something I wanted to do it was easy. So are you still shaving your head? Yes. Yes. Um, Sunday night. Sunday at 8pm. Are you absolutely bricking it? Actually I'm really looking forward to it yeah. because this hair is so damaged and so you know over bleached and you know, I'm just looking forward to having fresh hair and I mean raising £26,000 of charity on top. I love your Harry Potter video. Love it, absolutely love it. What house? I know you've only just met me, but what house would you put me in? Um, strong, um, not evil, not evil. Gryffindor? Yeah, that is what I wanted. <laughs> what type of dinosaur? Yeah, I like a long neck. Really? Yeah. Really? I'd like to be. Um, it's got to be a classic T Rex. It's got to be. Tiny arms. Yeah, yeah. Tiny arms. Tiny arms. What are you what gonna do with those? Spinosaurus shows up. Screw you up. <laughs> I'll be a Spinosaurus, sod it. Sorry. There you go. Oh, come on. Wait, don't Please come after You're sticking me. with T-Rex. Yeah, I, I, we'll be the, we'll the T-Rex Spinosaurus friends. And all the dinosaurs are like, what are they doing hanging out? They're supposed to be eating each other. Yeah. Like, the comedy duo of the dinosaur <laughs> stage. Right, we're going to do a few uh, would you rathers, okay? okay? First one. Would you rather wake up and have a foot on your head and an or an arm... Oh, wait, wait, are we talking about just someone else's foot or an actual No, growth? an actual growth oh, foot. Wow, okay. Or an arm coming from your chest. An arm from my chest, I reckon. Yeah, from my chest, that'd be sick having three hands. Like, yeah, definitely. You can sort of conceal the fact that you've got an arm on your chest, but I mean, when you've got a foot sticking out of your head, I mean, you got especially if you've got no hair, like I'm gonna have. Would you rather have a leg that randomly, every so often turned into a pogo stick? That would be sick. Like this, every so often, gave you a demonstration, or an arm that every so often would spontaneously burst into boy band moves, so you would Last one sounds. That's no. That, that sounds good. Leg, like. Because if I was just walking down the street and I was like, oh, this is such a long walk, and it turned into a like pogo stick, sick. Yeah, leg all day, leg. Back so, off that. Yeah. can you not? You could do that off your legs, but I mean. <laughs> can you not do boy band moves? Is that what this is all about? I don't need an extra arm. I can just go with the flow. So. Give us one. Uh, I'll copy you. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna do the power fist. Amazing. We're going to do no, 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 no. And no, don't go I'm breaking my heart. Yay! Look at that. I'm, I'm thinking of intimate situations okay. where I wouldn't, like, where I wouldn't really want the arm to do that. But otherwise, that sounds like that, that'd cheer people up. Whereas the, the whole leg thing, that just sounds like an accident waiting to happen. A little bit awkward, yeah, you just suddenly start hopping health, on the spot. Health, health and safety first, okay? Yeah. 